I've been preaching at teachers for many years on the need to back up their, their computer files. It's not if their hard drive is going to fail, it's when it's going to happen. Especially, they need to do this uh, to take advantage of the, all the storage they have available to them with their Google Apps for Education or their G Suite accounts. Uh, teachers in our region and anywhere, if you're using Google Apps for Education, have unlimited file storage in their drive. Uh, and Google has made this now one giant step easier to back up your files with the introduction of backup and sync for Google Drive. Uh, it also works for Google Photos, uh, but Google has, has released a new application as of about five, six days ago uh, that is literally just a couple of clicks to get your computer files backed up and saved to your Google Drive account. Uh, I will post the, uh, the link for this article here, but if you just search backup for Google Drive, uh, you should be able to find it, uh, but it's here. It literally is you download it, you install it, check a couple of boxes and say uh, go. And so let's show you how to do it. I've already uh, followed the link here for uh, Google Drive downloads right there. It takes me to this site here. Download backup and sync. It says I agree and download. It uh, backs or downloads to my computer. I've already done that. Thanks for downloading. When you open, uh, at least on a Mac, you just literally drag and drop that into your applications folder. And then once you open up Backup and Drive, Backup and Sync for Google, you get a little toolbox application here. And you just come in here and go to Settings or Preferences. And this is what you do to, to choose what you want to back up. Once it takes a minute to calculate the size of your of your desktop folder and your documents folder. Just check those little boxes. I'm already uploading my pictures to Google Photos uh, through my personal account, so I'm not going to check that. But if you want to back up your pictures as well, go ahead and check that. A couple of preferences down here. Uh, I'm choosing not to sync my Google Drive to this computer. It's already on Google Drive. Uh, and so I don't want that stuff coming back to this computer. If you want to do that, you can as well. And then under settings, you may just want to check uh, open this on startup so that it's always backing up your account. And then once that's done, you say OK. And that's it. The little icon here says it's starting to sync. And your stuff's going to be backed up. Whenever you make a change, uh, those changes will be backed up on Google. Uh, and your stuff should be safe. Uh, so really, there is no excuse anymore to not back up your computer files. Uh, please take a, a minute, literally a minute, to set this up on your home computer, on your school computer, uh, so that your stuff is safe. Thanks.